Hello there, everyone. Mage Lord Exelberth here, and I have a shotgun. Why do I have a shotgun? Well, I am going to be starting up my my uh, Mage Lord Tales series again. It's not going to be called Mage Lord Tale anymore, though. You'll you'll see the new tile when I release the first episode. But I'm going to be doing it on my server again. And I wanted to just just screw around a little bit with the mod pack we're going to be using. This is a slightly modified version of the mod sauce pack, the Hermitcraft mod sauce pack. And it's got just a ton of stuff that I've been screwing around with. And I think I'll do another video with, with the stuff that's currently behind me right now. Just because I wanted to talk about it. Huh, my hands actually move. It's kind of weird. One hand shotgun, two hand shotgun. And... Jungle music? That's what I think of when I hear this music. It's jungle music. Anyway, let's get out of that mode. So, what I'm going to do in this video is... Because it's got the Flans Weapons mod and... Some vehicles from that, I wanted to try fighting the Ender Dragon with the vehicles. And I thought that would be pretty entertaining to record. And I am going to be record... I'm going to be doing the fight in survival mode. So I'm just going to give myself a couple healing potions for the fight. Now I'm only going to be using weapons from the from Flans mod. We are going to be using a couple sentry guns, a Huey Cobra with a V6 engine, a MIM anti-aircraft with a V4 engine. It's got I got all the missiles I need for it. The Huey does have a gun on it, but I can't use the gun because the gun is bent for the gunner seat and I'm going to be in the pilot seat, so yeah. If that fails, I'm going to be on foot using a Remington 870, an M14, and an FN SCAR. And for instances where I feel it might be necessary, an RPG-7. I feel this is going to be a fairly entertaining fight. So let me just grab everything. We're going to try being in the helicopter first. Now, the problem with this is I'm going to have to load the helicopter while the dragon is flying at me. And that might not work out very well for me. I'm going to put the RPG ammo over here. Get some grenades. Get all this stuff. Okay, so my Remington is basically going to be my close range weapon if I have to fight on the ground. The Scar, I am hoping, will be enough to take out the dragon. But if need be, I have the M14. You know, this is a heavy amount of equipment to be going into a fight with. I think a normal person would, like, snap in half underneath all the weight from all this equipment. Thankfully, Minecraftians are able to carry tons of weight. Literally, tons. Okay, so... Oh, you know what I need, I'm going to need? I'm going to need some food. Let's get myself myself some good food, because this has Pam's Harvest Craft, so why not get myself something tasty to eat? Let's see. Fish and chips, because I'm wearing, I'm wearing the SAS outfit. Yeah. Okay, so... Swap over, and there goes the music. Well, that's 
Shame. Oh, and I have had this in peaceful mode because I didn't want to be bothered with any mobs r running around. And in we go. And hopefully it doesn't crash. Alright, let's get moving. I came here earlier just to clear out the... Clear out a pathway up here. There's the dragon, and... Oh, he is shooting fireballs. I was not expecting that. Come on, helicopter. Helicopter. Oh, I forgot the fuel! Uh, creative mode, quick. Helicopter, you cannot fly. You don't have fuel. Stop. Stop flying. <laughs> How can I forget the most important part of the vehicle? The gas. Okay. I am tipping sideways. What the heck am I afflicted with? Well, the good thing is we don't have to repair it. Okay, back to survival mode. Hello, dragon. Okay, we need to load up the missiles, not the guns. I keep on hitting E. So we can switch to F5 for a better view. My helicopter is on fire. Oh, hi, dragon. I wonder if the dragon flying through me actually damages me at all. Alright, let's take out the crystals. So the dragon can't heal. Is that a building... I am going to have to check that out later. I'm actually pretty good at flying a helicopter in Minecraft. Which is surprising considering there's not really helicopters in Minecraft in the first place. Oh, and I am now poisoned. And my cat is clawing at my chair. I also seem to have gone blind. Kitty, I do not need you to make this more difficult. Are the pillars actually exploding? Oh god, cat claws in my leg. The pillars are actually exploding. I did not expect that. Hi, dragon. Don't mind me. I'm just going to keep blowing up your... And I managed to hit myself. That's wonderful. Ah, completely missed that one. Okay, that obsidian turned into TNT. And that was a failure on my part to hit that one. How are we doing on missiles? I'm down to eight. This is not looking good for me killing the dragon in the helicopter. Especially since I don't seem to damage it very much. You have to admit, though, flying in a helicopter in the end is pretty much as easy as you're going to get. For flying a helicopter. Because there's plenty of space for you to be flying around. I'm just going to use my last missiles, taking out more of these things. And then we will try the anti-aircraft missiles. I just noticed that this is an angry Ender Dragon. Perhaps that's why it's spitting fireballs. Also, I can't really keep track of where it is. Oop. 
I think I might have found it. Ender Dragon. Ender Dragon. Okay, it's time for me to just get, get going. Shotgun time. No, wrong button. Okay, shotgun does not work on Enderman, and now I'm dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was pretty fun. Alright, let me gather some new things together, and we'll try this again. Alright, so we're going to go in a little bit lighter this time around. Since there's tons of Endermen in the end, and pretty much all the guns are not going to work on them because it's range damage, and Endermen are not affected by range damage whatsoever, I think that I'm going to just try going in Diamond Armor, and dual wielding diamond warhammers for doing damage to the Endermen. And an M14 to take on the Ender Dragon. But I still want to see if the anti-aircraft actually will attack the the Ender Dragon. Also, I want to have a sentry. Because I like sentries. Okay. Back into survival, and here we go. I'm not sure my cats like me recording things. Ah, oh, hello, slime. I am stuck in the ground. That kind of was cheaty. Get. Get out of here. You're not welcome here. Jeez. Calm down, Ender angry Ender Dragon. He blew up the spawn platform. Whoa! Jeez, you know, this Ender expansion stuff is really going to make things a lot more difficult if we ever go here for real. Okay, let's hop down. I'm going to get blown up. And now I'm on fire. Great. It's great. It's wonderful. Thank you, Ender Dragon. How am I supposed to fight this guy for real? Seriously, there's nothing but explosions happening all around me. Okay, fuel. I think that he destroyed my chances of using this. Can I hit him? I hit him with it! And here he comes to end my life. Hi, zombies. I think the dragon's also destroying Endstone, which is not supposed to be something he can do. Okay. So, things have gone horribly wrong. I forgot to reload this before entering. I am not hitting him at all. I'm also not hitting that. Jeez! This Ender Dragon! Are all Ender Dragons going to be angry Ender Dragons because of this mod? Why can I not hit anything with my gun? Well, I think that we are safe saying I'm not going to be able to beat the Ender Dragon with, with modern weaponry. But I have one last thing I want to try. So let, let me actually show you what I am doing to do all this stuff.
All right, so I tried opening that hardcore ender expansion thing or whatever the heck it was in the upright corner just to get the message out of here, and it caused me to crash. Oh, it's those flowers. Ignore those. It's Britannia. Not messing with it right now. Okay, so we're going to try a plane. The Tornado F3, because the Ender Dragon is moving very fast. So, obviously we're going to have to move very fast as well. And it requires an engine of any sort. I'm going to give it a V8 engine. Also requires one of these. I think it was one of these. Four wheels. <clears throat> Two wings. Five bone meal. A gray die and a propeller. And a cone. One gray die, one, two, three, four, five. And the wings, right. And craft, and we now have a tornado. Which I will make certain I get equipped before we go in this time. Let's see, we're gonna need some rockets, and M60E4 ammo. Get the fuel in. Oops. It's going to have a lot of missiles in it. Dang, I keep hitting the wrong button. Man, I think that there's only one seat in here, so it's all controlled by one person. I actually can put a lot more missiles in. There we go. Alright, so now when I break this and replace it You can see it's still God's inventory. So, I should be able to just place it in the end and have everything. Let's get rid of the clone. And let's see. I think Builder's Wands are in here, right? No, they're in Extra Utilities. We're going to fly away from the main dragon area. And we're going to try to make a runway for my plane. And then we'll see what we can do in the fight. I'm not going to bother with anything else because if this fails, I'm done. <laughs> Alright, see you in the end. Alright, so here is our runway. It might not be quite long enough, but as soon as we're off the runway, the plane will probably have enough time to get up to speed so we start flying before we plummet into the void. Hopefully. And just to make sure, I'm going to bring a couple extra clips of ammo. Alright. Ammo would be right here. Okay. So. What the heck was that? I wonder if that got picked up on the recording. Because it sounded like something glitching out. Okay. This is going to be fun. And... In survival mode. Away we go! 
And down we go. Where am I going? <laughs> this is the downside of flying the plane in the end. Can't really see where you're going very well. You can make really sharp turns of this plane. Ha! I hit it! I'm better at flying a plane in Minecraft than I am in games where you're supposed to fly a plane. Is that sad? Uh, do, am I on missiles or something? No. Oh, jeez. Hello, ground! And I have one wing, and I am gonna die. I've turned into a torpedo! I will not give in! Oh, I'm gone. <laughs> uh, that was pretty funny. Well, there you have it. Fighting the Ender Dragon with modern weapons. Not exactly that easy. There's one weapon I haven't tried yet, though. I've turned into an Enderman. Hmm. Alright, let's get the final weapon out. For our final weapon, we have a T-90 tank. Jeez, it's Ender Dragon. It is... Such an aggressive dragon. I need to have the time to put down the tank. Alright. I did barely any damage to it. Well, I can hit it when it's point blank. That's a good thing, I guess. The tank uses RPD ammo. This one does, anyway. There's too many of those things left. Uh, tank. There we go. Fire your shots. Where is the front of this thing? Okay. The front is this way. It's hard to figure out which way you're going to be going. I think I'm out of RPD ammo. Thankfully, I have tons of shells left. Come on, get down lower. This tank cannot shoot you if you go high. Oh, so you go high. Thanks a lot, dragon. Dragon? Dragon. Okay, the dragon's calling in lightning. That is not fair. Where'd he go? Dragon? Uh, hey, hey, hey. Yeah, tanks can beat Enderman. Unfortunately, oh hey, my helicopter's alive. Where'd the dragon go? 
That's my only concern right now. Where's the dragon? That and perhaps getting these... Oh dear, we're... We're kind of screwed. I think the dragon's made his appearance again. Well... I think that I'm about ready to say the dragon wins. Ooh! Got your foot! Yeah, you stay right there. That's actually perfect. <laughs> Somehow I'm staying alive. I wonder how my tank's doing, though. So... Might it be that the dragon is causing all these Endermen to go crazy? On purpose? I wonder how my tank's doing. It's... it's doing great! I can stay in here forever. How much... How many shells do I have? Hey, you come here and do that. How is this tank not taking damage from all these explosions? Does it does it just not take into consideration you might be foolish enough to take a tank to fight the Ender Dragon? I will beat you like this, dragon! Unless you decide to just start eating me. Am I gonna die like this? Or... <laughs> I'd call it a draw, but I'm clearly beating the dragon. This is cheaty, but I'm winning. Yeah! Got you in the butt! Uh, Dragon, could you, uh... Oh! I could tip it, maybe? Oh! Oh! Ah! How do I, Which way do I go to stop? Is it reverse? Okay, it's reverse. Dragon, could you... Could you tell me where you are, Dragon? Oh, you're up there. Is... Is the dragon summoning... Bats? These bats are annoying. I can say that much, at least. I want to be able to say in the title, Beat Ender Dragon in a Tank. Zombie, you are not doing anything helpful. Come on, dragon. Dragon! Dragon! I don't want to get out of this tank, ever. It's the only thing allowing me to live. 
but at the same time, it's making things hard to do. Like, shoot the dragon. Ah, I missed a point blank shot. You know, I'm starting to feel that the inevitable is going to be I run out of ammo, have no choice but to try to make it to the helicopter, and the dragon destroys me. But you know, this has been fun. Can't wait to face the Ender Dragon for real. Come on. I've got... 18 shots left. Oh, there you are, dragon. He is not a happy dragon. Which is why he's called an angry ender dragon. only goal right now is to angrily bring things to an end. And since I'm the only two things that he can end, I guess he's gonna try to do that. Look, it's my tank. It's my helicopter. Hooray! What am I doing? How many more shots? Six shots! Come on, dragon! I'm tired of you doing this. Tank, what are you doing? Tank? Holy Jesus! Dragon. Dragon. How are you healing? I destroyed all your things. Where'd he go? above me. Yep. Only two damage? Jeez. Alright, how many... How many shells? One shell! At this point, it's not even worth it. Go, go. Gotta try it. I think I have no ammo in here at all. Yep. Well, you win, dragon. You win. I can't beat you with any modern weapons. Though I tried so hard, and look at the carnage. This is... This is very foreboding as to what is probably going to happen to me in my main series. Although in that one, I probably will be on foot rather than in a vehicle. And may have slightly better tools to fight the dragon with. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this fun little pointless screw around video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and fave if you did. And I will see you in another video, whenever that may be, guys. Take care, and goodbye. Kamikaze to the void!
dragon wins.